Hey, it's Dr. Schmidt. I have a couple of great successes I want to share with you. I'm going to walk you through the process that got them better. I have this patient with more Gellin's disease, which is where parasites or some crazy stuff comes out of your skin. I've been working with her for a year and a half. This is what happened. So the diet needed to be uh, high in meat. And then the energy production and the mitochondria had to go up. I got supplements for that. And you need to make sure that her intestines work well, especially her liver and gallbladder. Then to get rid of parasites out of her intestines. If she's getting parasites out of her skin, then she probably has parasites on the inside of her body. And she successfully got rid of parasites. And we accomplished all the way through steps five. And it did not change her skin. Then I detoxed her step six. And we did that for many months, right? This has been a year and a half and it did not change her symptoms, right? Now I talked to her yesterday and now she's better. She's a hundred percent better. And she said to me, what do we do next? Do we never talk again because I'm better? Cause I'm cured. I said, no, we do maintenance checkups. Maybe every three or four months we can talk on the phone. And she said, okay, well, what was it that made her better? Step seven the Lyme organisms, the supplements to get rid of Lyme out of the body. That's what got her better. But you can't just jump in and do step seven. You have to do the detoxification earlier and the parasites and the preparation and the diet. So all these earlier steps, one through six, prepares you for step seven. Now, some people get better with just the diet. Other people get better when they get rid of the parasites. Other people get better when they're detoxed. And then not everybody needs to do step seven, but some people need step seven to get better. I have another patient and he had uh, melanoma. They cut it out and they had a scar and some uh, lack of drainage for the lymphatic system. His right arm was swollen up. So I had him treat the scar from the surgery. I put him on some lymphatic support supplements. And in a week, he was like 80% better with that right arm swelling. It was much reduced. His energy went up. That's step two. We put him on, he went on the carnivore diet. That's step one. All these things helped. And then to get the drainage out, the lymphatic system drainage, that's step three. This is all within the first few weeks. And now that it's been, what, six weeks or so? Today or yesterday, when I saw him, I said, okay, now we're going to do step four. You're going to get parasites out of your body when you go to the bathroom. It might be tapeworms might be mucoid plaque, and it might be uncomfortable, and it might make you feel worse. So notice how steps one, two, and three, you're climbing up, getting better. And I told them you might feel worse because look, it goes from step four to five and it goes down. You might feel worse. Welcome to the club. It tells us that it's working. Now he was feeling happy and, and better, and I'm just preparing him and he, he laughed about it. I'm like, yep, this is what we have to go through to get the parasites out. Out of, the, out of the intestines, out of the body. Then we'll start some detoxification because we're trying to prevent cancer from ever coming back. And he said yesterday when he came in, he told my staff that he no longer feels like an old man. He's lost, I don't know, 20, 30 pounds. I forgot how much he's lost, but he's doing a lot better just with steps one, two, and three. So there's a couple of examples of my thought process when I'm getting people better. I don't care if it's what disease, what disease condition it is. Name the disease, doesn't matter. These are the steps that you go through to get better. So the first example, that was more more Jellin's disease. I mean, people storm the Capitol buildings because nobody's got a cure for more Jellin's disease. Well, I had success with that. And it's in these steps right here. Okay, so keep thinking with this. If you're a natural healthcare practitioner, steal this screenshot, use it, think with it, um, use the correct products. And I'll see you at the next video.